Should you be using Wix stores or Equid stores? That's the question I'm going to help you answer in today's video regarding how to set up an online store in Wix. Now this is a comparison video and uh, I will describe how to start the setup of an online store, but I want to show you the initial decision making process. I'm your host, Michael Strout, Computer MD of Gilbert, and I'm excited to hop into it. Guys, before we hop into that section, um, for all of you that are, you know, familiar and subscribe to me here on the channel that follow me uh, that are probably on my weekly Wix tips as well which you could go to wixmywebsite.com and sign up for the weekly Wix tips um, I have a little request for you I have this little questionnaire uh, that I will put in the link in the description below and I would love if you guys could fill it out I'm trying to enhance my quality this year, that's one of my goals for 2018. I'm trying to create more targeted quality, um, better content, and that starts with hearing from you guys. I need to know what you like best, what you'd like to see, and what's been most helpful thus far. You can see it's th this is it. It's a qu few quick questions. If you could hop on there, it's just a bunch of drop downs pretty much. Last question is optional. And go ahead and answer those. That'd be really helpful for me. I appreciate that. Link in the description below. Now, like I said, the question is Wix stores or Equid? So let's do a little comparison. So I'm going to show you one, how to add Wix stores to your Wix website. So to add Wix stores, you're going to come over here to add apps and you're simply going to type in Wix stores. You'll click that and then you'll click add to site. And then Wix stores is added to your site. It's added as a page. Now let's examine this first. In order, you see this right here, in order to accept online payments, to accept any form of payment in your store, anything online, even Wix bookings, all these different apps, you need to get the e-commerce plan with Wix. This is important to know. So when you do get that e-commerce plan, you can then start accepting payments. I know a lot of people run into this issue where they say, okay, I've got my online store um, built up and then I go to try to pay, but it says, it won't allow me to or you cannot accept payments. That is because you need that e-commerce plan. So that's something to know. Uh, if we click get started here, this is our store manager. Um, we'll open that in a second. And then you'll see our store pages. So we can see the different pages in the Wix stores. You can see that they're customizable. If you click settings, uh, you can choose the page layout, uh, the permissions of the page, the SEO, page info, all of that. The cart, you can even come in here, see see how it looks, uh, change the uh, angle of it and your thank you page as well. Uh, then you have store elements. So this is where you can add uh, widgets, galleries, um, add to cart buttons, and then these different related apps down here. And then obviously learn more section. Now, important to note here, uh, you can see if we click this and then click uh, manage store we come into the store dashboard again this is Wix stores guys so you come in here and then you have the option to add all of your products in here you can see you can add a digital file or a physical item so a digital file is most likely going to be downloaded upon purchase whereas your physical item like they say here in the example t-shirt shoes or skateboard will be shipped out so it will require shipping uh, and then they have different product options. If you select physical, you could upload the title, images, videos. So this is a new feature. You can now add videos uh, to your products as well. Uh, your pricing descriptions, if it's like a new arrival, uh, your inventory, any additional uh, info sections like a return policy, care instructions. You can have the buyer use custom text if you're doing like a customized product and then you could add product variations here like size color material all of that you can even launch uh, coupons and email campaigns using Wix shout out which is a pretty nice integration so when we're comparing that one to Equid uh, this has automatic Wix shout out integration so it can easily attach to your email list so you could send out like new product alerts anything like that so that is something to take note of when looking at Wix stores. Ultimately, they give you all the tools you need to create your online store and add your products in a basic format. You can add collections, you can process and see your orders for, from right here. Again, you have to upgrade to order, uh, accept online payments. 
your store promotions you could create coupons it's very easy to do and then like I said the email marketing this is where it integrates with Wix shout out where you have all of these uh, email marketing campaigns you can send out it's pretty nice it's pretty convenient that is a plus to Wix stores then you come into your business setup you add your um, business information your payment methods uh, Wix stores allows you to add either PayPal credit or debit cards except uh, manual so this could be uh, cash check other custom forms of payment or you could accept your square card reader um, so if, if you're picking up an item anything like that uh, you could add shipping and tax policies right here uh, you can see you can add new regions determine how the tax and the shipping are calculated um, and you could decide how you want to break that up per region if you're only shipping United States you can simply just check off international if you are going to do international you may want to break it into regions or countries or continents however you wanted to do that and then your store settings right here so this includes like all of your uh, all of your settings pretty much email notifications so when an order is placed when an order has been shipped when it's ready for pickup or like it says right here a digital product order you could set your policies, your contact us, refunds, terms and conditions, privacy, all that. And this will determine your currencies, price format, measurement format, everything there. And the nice thing is now Wix has a mobile app that you can manage your online store straight from the Wix app. So this is something that's very convenient um, and easy because you get notifications sent to you as soon as orders have been made on your online store. And you could go ahead and determine... Uh, view the order and fulfill it or manage the order you can even add and edit products straight from the Wix mobile app as well so Wix stores is pretty good as far as integrating uh, obviously it's a Wix app so I, I'm a huge fan of Wix apps it integrates well with Wix shout out the only thing it does lack is it is lacking a lot of um, kind of more custom online store uh, features such as you know creating wish lists which with Wix code that can now be done however you have to stray away from Wix stores in order to use that because Wix code is custom built so you don't have things like um, like I use an example wish list or the customization of your cart page is very minimal um, the customization really of any of your online store pages is pretty minimal it is slightly disappointing with how minimal it is um, but you see here if you come in here to settings you can determine your layouts so I mean you can still customize your pages it's just it only goes to a certain extent as you can see you could you could design the colors um, how it looks as far as you know your online store feel all together uh, it, it's just not as custom as it could be and I know they're working on this and I know they're looking to improve this um, but there are still new features that most online stores should have that Wix stores has to incorporate so next let's take a look at uh, an Equid control panel this is a little different and with Equid let me just explain it right now you would go right here to at our uh, app market again and you would just type in Equid and then you'll see online store by Equid. You would also click add to site. If we did that, you could click add app. And then you can manage your Equid store straight from here too. This is the control panel that they'll provide you. Equid, on the other hand, is much more customizable and a little bit more, um, uh, I don't want to say user-friendly because the Wix app is extremely user-friendly. But the, the Equid store enables you to be able to do more with your online store uh, it, it has more reports uh, better better tracking better order management um, different sales channels uh, starter websites more custom designs uh, better settings stuff like that so there's a lot more you can do however I will say something with which stores you have to upgrade to uh, the e-commerce plan in order to accept online payments. Now, with Equid, it's a little bit different. You get access to all their basic functions and everything you need as a backbone to start your online store, but in order to start getting some of those 
um, more unique and custom kind of fields and content and design, you have to upgrade. So if we just go to something as simple as reports, discounts, catalogs, or just my sales, if you go into my sales, you can track your orders here, but a feature like the abandoned car feature, this is where you can track the abandoned carts and send recovery emails to increase your sales. This has to be upgraded in order to do that. Um, and on Equid, you can see right here, there's different plans. 15 is the venture, $35 a month is business. The Wix e-commerce e plan is $24 a month. Um, and and that, that includes everything and as far as selling online. But Equid has, you can see, it's just a little bit more intuitive, especially if we go to the settings here. So we can see the general settings and then there's tons of different settings in here. But you could choose, you know, all of your business information, your cart and checkout settings, your legal pages, you know, your about me's, shipping, return policy, privacy policies, your tracking. You could add Google Analytics IDs and Facebook pixels, although this is an upgradable one as well. Uh, you could come in here, add custom tax information. Uh, your mail would be your email notifications. Design how they look. Um, you also have more email notifications available to you compared to uh, Wix, although Wix does incorporate with Wix shout out. So if you have people sign up for your email list on your Wix website and they're signing up to Wix shout out, you have customization there. It's a little easier to use. Um, and then your invoice setting, customer groups, product types, store labels, all of that. Uh, you have access to all of that. You also have access to the app market here on Equid, which allows you to implement a lot of different things. So this is what diversifies Equid, in my opinion, from Wix stores. Wix stores, that is the app. That is the Wix stores app. Anything that Wix does from now on, they have to add on to that app. Equid, on the other hand, you have your online store, you have your dashboard, you have all of your settings, but then you have the ability to add external apps. So a big one is if you want a drop shipper, Printful, that's a popular drop shipper. You can add the Printful drop shipping to Equid, which means if you don't know what drop shipping is, it means that when someone places an uh, order on your store, you are not in charge of fulfillment at all. You work with your drop shipper, create the designs, and then they do all of the work. They create the product, print the product, ship the product. All of that is done. You are in charge of the business aspect of that. So that's a huge, huge game changer here, which really increases equity. Listen, I'm a huge fan of the Wix stores. Um, I love it. I love all Wix apps. However, if you are going for a more custom online store e-commerce platform, you're definitely going to want to use Equid over Wix stores in my opinion. However, if you're just looking for an easy to use, just simple online store, you're just going to sell your products, no customization really, just go with it, um, have your basic email notifications, you're going to fulfill all your orders yourself or even sell digital goods, then go with which stores. It's easier to use. It's a little less complex. Equid is a little bit more complex, which means there's a little bit more of a learning curve. There's more time involved into Equid. However, you get a more custom looking uh, online store. So it comes down to weighing pros and cons. However, if you're asking for my opinion at the current moment, I would use Equid over Wix stores. Just the sheer fact of customization. There's so much more customization with Equid than Wix stores. Guys, I hope this video was insightful for you, gave you an idea to start with as far as creating an online store on Wix. And if it did, please drop me a like down below. Comment if you have any questions at all or you want me to answer any you know concerns, questions, comments you might have about these two platforms and moving forward. And guys, don't forget to subscribe to me here on Computer MD of Gilbert. I have tons of Wix content coming out. You guys don't even know. This is going to be a huge year. But most of all, if you haven't already, head over to wixmywebsite.com and sign up for these weekly Wix tips. They're helping people so often. Each week I get emails about how my Wix tips and my team's Wix tips have been able to help them grow their business or learn something new on Wix. So please feel free to reach out. 
And to end with everything, I wanted to let you know that uh, my team is standing by. We are available for hire. So if you're looking to hire out for your online store, we do build online stores. Feel free to head over to wastemywebsite.com, check the hire the expert section, and let's get something going. I'd love to chat with you, discuss your project details. Other than that, I hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day. Thanks for spending a couple minutes with me, and I hope you were I was able to help you out.